Um, my name is Jennifer Tarango and I help busy moms reach their fitness goals through low impact modified workouts and simple nutrition tips. If this is your first time joining me for a workout, make sure you smash that subscribe button so that you never miss a workout or a training. Okay guys, so I will be here every week giving you more tips and tricks or workouts for you to help to help you reach your fitness goals. So let's get warmed up. Um, today we're doing our super set workout. So it's gonna be a full body workout, strength workout. And so you do need dumbbells or kettlebells. Um, we're going to be doing moves like deadlifts and squats. So if you have some heavier weights that you can use, that's really going to benefit you, um, to start building muscle and strength, right? So you might want a lighter set of weights and then a heavy set of weights that you can start there and then drop if you need to. Okay. Let's get warmed up. March it out here. Okay, guys, let's step touch right here. We step touch. Good. Warming up that body here. This is eight, seven, good, six. Four more, four more, four, three, two. Knees up here, so knee up. Good, abs tight, chest lifted. Four more, four more, four. Three, two, and one. Good, heels forward. We push forward. Four, three, two, and one here. Good, knee to elbow. Good, bring that knee across, elbow across. Good, for four, three, two, and one, march it out, we march. Okay guys, heels forward, forward. Good, hold that right heel forward. Sit that hip back. Good, stretching through the hamstring here. Good, and other side. Awesome job guys, bring it up. And lateral lunge here, good, knee over the ankle. And over to the other side. Okay, guys, and walk those feet in. Good. Let's go ahead and stretch that back and round it up. Good. And flat back down and round it up here. All the way up. Awesome. Let's grab those weights. Okay, so I'm going to use a kettlebell to start. Um, I also have some dumbbells. So. Um, we're gonna start with a deadlift. So you want your feet about hip width apart. So we're working on that hip hinge here, the bottom reaching back like you're closing a cabinet. So if you bring the weight forward here and keep the bottom where it's at, that's gonna hurt your lower back. So you wanna keep the weight coming right down the front of the legs and shoot the bottom back like you're closing your kitchen cabinet, yeah? So we're gonna start there. We have eight reps, shoulders down and back, chest lifted, nice flat back, ready? Let's go, so this is Eight, seven, okay guys, six, five, reach that bottom back, four, squeeze, three, two, and one, awesome job, good. And now we have a goblet squat. So if you're holding a dumbbell, same thing. Yeah, you can hold it here, goblet, goblet style. I'm gonna hold um, this kettlebell. Yeah, so you want it in front. This is a front squat. So, and then we're gonna take this as a sumo squat. So we're gonna take those feet wider than hip width and we're gonna point the toes out more so than a regular squat, yeah? So now we're coming down and up. So we have eight, exhale, squeeze. Seven, chest stays lifted. Six, press those knees back. Five, four, three, two, and one. Good job, guys. 
Okay, little break here, and then we're gonna go back to our deadlift. Okay. So again, coming back to that deadlift, shoulders down and back, chest lifted. Feet about hip width apart. Ready? Let's go. So this is eight, that bottom reaches back. Seven. Six. Good. Five. Four more. Four. Three, exhale, squeeze. Good. Two and one good squat toes out sumo squat ready let's go this is eight seven six good five four three two and one awesome job guys little break here Okay, we have one more set of these exercises, so just eight and eight. And the way that you would progress this workout is, you know, next week doing heavier weights or adding additional reps. Okay, getting ready, last round. Shoulders down and back, chest lifted. Ready, let's go. So this is eight, seven, Good, five, that bottom reaches back. Four, three, good guys. Two, and one. Awesome job, right into that sumo squat, goblet squat, ready, let's go. This is eight, seven, six. So if you don't have heavier weights, five, you could always do 10 reps, yeah? Four, three, two, press those knees back, and one. Awesome job, guys. Good, grab a sip of water if you need it. Next, we're gonna be working arms. So we have biceps and triceps. So we're gonna take a Zotman curl for this one. So you have weights come up, rotate, and down. Yeah, those elbows stay in here. So we have eight of those, shoulders down and back, chest lifted. Ready, let's go. So this is eight. Awesome. Seven. Six. Five. Good, four more. Four. Three. Knee soft, two, rotate, and last one. Good job, guys. Now we're gonna take our tricep kickback, so we have a nice flat back here. The, the weights come up by the hips, the elbows are pulled back here at that 90 degree angle, and we're just gonna kick back here. So we have eight. Don't let the elbows drop. If you need to use lighter weights here, you can. Good. Four more, four, three, two, abs tight, exhale one. Okay guys, bring it up, little break. Then we'll come back to our Zotman curls. Shoulders down and back, chest lifted, let's get ready. Let's go, this is eight, good, seven, slow and controlled, six, don't drop that weight. Five, good. Four more, let's go. Four. Three. Almost there. Two. And last one. Okay guys, right into that tricep. Nice flat back, abs tight, pull those weights up. Let's go. Eight, seven. Five, good, four, three, two, and one. Bring it up, little rest. One more round of this exercise. Shoulders down and back, chest lifted. 
abs tight, knees soft. Let's get ready for those Zotman curls. Last set, ready, let's go. This is eight, good. Seven, don't let that weight, that weight drop. Six, good. Five, four more. Four, three, two, and last one. Awesome job. Good, right into those triceps. Ready, let's go. This is eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Good, guys. Little break here, then we'll move on to our last set of exercises. So this is gonna be a lateral lunge with a overhead press. So we're gonna take that weight in, in front of the shoulder. Yeah, so you don't want it resting on the shoulder. This is gonna challenge the core a little bit more. So by stepping out into that lateral lunge, yeah, knee over the ankle, and then we press up overhead. As that weight comes overhead, the weight is slightly in front of the head, not back here, yeah? Make sure you pull that belly button in and up so you're not putting any strain on the lower back here. So again, the weight is in front of the shoulder so that you're challenging that core and we're working unilaterally. So one side of the body, um, which is really great um, for working muscle imbalances, uh, and just strengthening one side and then the other instead of working together. Um, it's good to train one side at a time sometimes as well. Lots of benefits. Okay, so ready, let's go. We have our eight reps. This is eight, good, seven, bottom goes back, six, good guys, five, four more, four, chest lifted, three, two, and one. Good, so our second move is just the other side. So again, weight in front of the shoulder, ready, let's go. This is eight, seven, six, abs tight, five, four more, four, three, two, and one. Good, little break, little break. How we doing? Okay, two more sets. Good, so weight in front of that right shoulder. Ready, let's go. This is eight, seven, six, five, good, four, three, two, and last one. Yes, good. Other side, ready? Let's go. This is eight, seven, six, five. Good guys, four, three, and one. Awesome job. Little break, last round. Okay, ready? Let's go. Eight, seven, six, chest lifted, abs tight, five, bottom back, four, three, two, and one. Good guys. Last one, let's go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Awesome job, guys. 
You can drop that weight. Very good, okay. Let's just take a little cool down. So we're just gonna march here. Grab a sip of water if you need it. Good, nice deep breath. Good, and exhale. One more deep breath. And exhale. Okay guys, we're gonna take those lateral lunges. So just side to side here. Little stretch. Good. And hold it over to the right. Awesome, we're gonna turn here. Press that back heel down. Good. Take those arms in front, separate the shoulder blades here. And just drop that back knee. Pelvis forward, stretching through that hip flexor. You can reach that opposite hand up and over for a little stretch all the way up through the side of the body. And release. Good, stretching through that hamstring. Good, toe down, roll it around, roll up. Lateral lunge to the left. Okay guys, knee over the ankle here. Good, and turn, press that back heel down, stretching through the calf, take those arms behind you. Open up through the chest. Good, drop that back knee down, stretching through that hip flexor. Good, pull that back foot in, sit back, stretching through the hamstring. Good, toe down, roll it around, roll up. Good, quadricep, you can grab a wall or a chair. Yeah, knees stay close together here. Press those hips forward. Good, and other side. Awesome job, guys. And let's just take a deep breath in. Feel free to stretch anything else you need to stretch. And awesome job. Okay, if you haven't clicked that subscribe button yet, make sure you do that right now because I will be back here next week with more workouts, more tips on how you can reach your fitness goals. Okay, Mwah. bye.